So what do you expect the PC requirements to be for Cyberpunk 2077? Requirements are recommended. Those are two different things. Um, What's going to be the nicest for the best experience? Well, let me, let me step back a second. Step I back. fully expect that Cyberpunk will run and many people will, will say it's just fine on a four core eight thread chip. They certainly want to target a wide audience. They want to sell millions of copies of their game. And so people with an i7 4790K or a, or even like the new Ryzen 3 3100 $99 chip, four core eight thread, it'll run, it'll play, it will, it'll function. I would call it a horrible experience. You would call it a horrible experience. Anybody who knows better would call it a horrible experience. But there's plenty of people who will do it and go, see, it plays my game. Why would I need to upgrade? Moving on from that, I think that six cores, 12 threads will run it well enough. I think that people who have a six core, 12 thread chip will find that it is a perf perfectly enjoyable, perfectly adequate experience. Most people would probably be happy enough and I don't say that with sarcasm because not everybody cares about the Uber Elite experience. Yeah. Not everybody cares about ultra smooth frame times. People just want to play their game and enjoy. Hey, look, plenty of people play games on an Xbox One, uh, you know, and yep. they play it, you know, 720p at 30 frames per second, upscaled to 1080p, and they go, what? It's fine. Not everybody cares. I do believe. Hold up your orange, please. Oh, my orange? No. <laughs> Aren't you glad? If you want a premium optimum experience, and if you want super smooth, pretty, nice gameplay, where the frame times are beautiful, where everything is responsive, there's no micro stutter, there's no hitches, there's no hiccups, there's no complaints, there's no issues, everything is just gorgeous. A Ryzen 9 3900X, 12 core, 24 thread chip is the ideal choice to play Cyberpunk 2077. It's not required, but it will be nice. And if you were to play the game on say a Ryzen 5 3600 and then play it on a 3900X back to back, you'd notice the difference.